Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Vikram. In this class, we'll try to understand Merth sort working mechanism. So, the concept of divide and conquer has already been explained in our previous method, uh, previous video. If you haven't watched that video, please watch that video and come back here. And every video on our channel is going to be part of entire course or a playlist. Our suggestion is to follow the entire course so that you can have better understanding of the concepts. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Now, let's try to understand. In this class, we'll try to understand how the Merth sort works. And uh, the Merth sort is based upon the uh, is designed based upon the concept of divide and conquer uh, so in the divide and conquer we have three steps one is given a problem that problem will get divided into small small problems sub problems and the division is 10 until the sub problem cannot be further divided so uh, to which level the division is done to that level to, to a certain level where the division cannot be done further to that level the division of sub problems is done first step is division the next step is conquer conquer means we are going to solve the sub problems solving the sub problems the second step is solving the sub problems and the third problem the, the third step is combining the sub problems the sol uh, the uh, the sub problems for which we have obtained the solutions so the conquered solutions will get combined so this is how the merge sort will work which is based upon the divide and conquer mechanism so first step is we have to divide this entire problem so the problem is given an array of elements and these elements are to be arranged in the sorted order first what we have to do we have to divide them into sub problems so how the division is done so how the division is done is it is based upon the uh, it is based upon the mid value so we are going to find the mid value and based upon that mid value we are going to divide this problem divide this array not physically logically we are going to divide it logically not physically so try to understand we are not just dividing this array into small small pieces so logically we are taking this part of the array and that part of the array and we are going to divide it further and we are going to only on that part of the array we are going to do the necessary action sorting and all that uh, all that is done on that part of array okay so that is what the uh, division means logically it is it will get divided not physically okay so now what is mid value here the mid value is low plus high by 2 low plus uh, high by 2 and we are going to take the floor value what is low and what is high low means it is the uh, 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 the smallest index and the highest index okay so now uh, first division is based on so for that uh, first division is 0 plus 7 by 2 0 plus 7 by 2 7 by 2 3.5 and we have to take the floor value 3.5 uh, floor value means it is going to be 3 okay so this is where the division has to be done 3 means here so th all these values are going to be one sub problem and all these values are going to be the another sub problem okay so this is where the division has to be done that is why we are going to find the mid value for the division purpose so what is the new sub problem that we have obtained the new sub problem is 3 6 4 1 and the indices are 1 0 1 2 3 and the other sub problem is the other sub problem is here are the values 8 5 2 7 and uh, the indices are 4 5 6 7 again so can this sub problem be further divided yes this can be further divided okay so how the division is made how the division is made is it is based upon the mid value so what is the mid value mid value is low plus high by 2 means the lowest index plus highest index by 2 0 plus 3 by 2 it is uh, 3 by 2 which is 1.5 the floor value is 1 okay so this is where the division has to be made okay so the division is so these two parts into one piece so again it is not uh, physically it is logically okay and uh, 0 1 and the other one is it is 4 1 okay and the indices are 2 and 3 again can this be divided yes it can be divided so where it has to be divided 4 plus 7 by 2 which is 11 by 2 which is a uh, uh, 5.5 5.5 means floor value 5 so this is where the division has to be done 
this is where the division has to be done and the values are 8 and 5 and here it is uh, 4 5 and uh, here the values are 2 and 7 and the indices are 6 and 7 okay so can these values be further divided yes they can be divided they can be divided into two two pieces okay so here 0 plus 1 by 2 0 plus 1 by 2 1 by 2.5 which is going to be floor value is going to be 0 okay so it is 3 and this one is 6 and the next one is 4 and this one is 1 and this one is 8 and this one is 5 and similarly this one is uh, 2 and this one will get divided into two pieces as in that way okay so the next so can this be further divided can these pieces be further divided no they cannot be divided so this is where the division is going to stop and the next uh, step of the divide and conquer is conquering the algorithm and combining so uh, conquering the algorithm means we have to sort them and we are going to combine so this taking these individual values so if you sort them they are going to be in the same position okay so uh, they will be in the same position they will remain in the same way and the next one in the next step we have to again take this so from where these two values has been obtained so these two values are obtained from this division from this sub problem we got these sub problems right and from this sub problem we got these sub problems so these two are to be conquered and we have to combine them okay so these two are conquered conquered means these two values are to be arranged in the sorted order so how they will get arranged uh, what is the algorithm what are the steps that are taken for these values to get sorted so that we will try to understand in our next video where we are going to discuss about our algorithm okay so at this point of time try to understand how the uh, division conquering and combining is done how the merge sort works that we will try to understand so here are these elements in the sorted order so they are they will get sorted so after sorting they will be 3 and 6 and the indices are 0 and 1 and these one will get combined and how, from where these sub problems are obtained these sub problems are obtained from here and these two sub problems are obtained from here and these two sub problems are obtained from here so this is how the uh, uh, combination is done finally to get the uh, sorted array now we have to conquer them so we have to arrange them in the sorted order and we have to combine them after arranging them we have to combine them so this is how the arrangement and com uh, combination is done conquer and uh, common is done combine is done and here it is they will also 8 and 5 so the right order is 5 and 8 and they got combined and here 2 and 7 they got combined again so these two problems now these two problems are to be conquered means they should be arranged in the sorted order and they should be combined so to combine them we need uh, uh, four okay so here the arrangement is one three four six so how the how they got arranged how they got into sorted order uh, we will try to understand in the algorithm part okay so this one got arranged and the next sub part is this is the sub part so why this is the sub part these two are the sub parts means these two are the sub parts these two are the sub problems which are obtained by this array try to get that point so these two sub problems are divided because of this array and we have to uh, we have to solve these two sub parts and we have to combine them okay so here it is uh, it is the sorted order is 2 5 7 8 okay in the final step we have to combine these two one two three four five six seven eight okay so now when you combine these two one here two here three four five six seven and the last one is eight so after combining these two uh, this one is going to be the final array so this this is how so this is what the this is how the merge sort will work by using the by using the design technique called divide and conquer
okay so this is how the merge sort working takes place and how this working happens is it is due to the algorithm so the clear understanding of algorithm we'll try to understand that in our next class hope you got the clarity on this concept thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates and if you have any doubts regarding this concept please post your doubt in the comment section below and if you feel that this video is helpful to you please give us a like symbol and please share this video with your friends so that they will also get benefited thanks for watching